Yeah, somebody, uh, I can't remember who, Sandy was telling me, somebody came into, her, into the store. Uh -huh. and yeah. But those people tend to come into the store, you know? People would be interested in stuff like that. Yeah. So I'm going to get another bag of the calorie rolls. Yeah. There you go. You got the yolk here. Yeah. What you need is... I wasn't going to act too good about that. No, that's... Yeah. No, she's not. So I, get, I just started working full time. I mean, I get Mondays off. Maybe she is. Uh, okay, maybe she does. I'm going to tell you that I now... Get up last Monday. Well, my job wasn't me doing this. I'm going to step back home. Just going to grab the rolls. When I were at home, I did it for a while, and it got work. I think I did. Yeah, well, I told my mom, because it's not great. I called him on the porch one night. I went out and yelled at him. Oh, he did it. Oh, I know. Yeah, 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 I know
Yeah. You know how to do. No, no. <laughs> the wedding you know, announcements in the papers are among the injured. Are. <laughs> Is it okay to take pictures? Please, Absolutely. please take pictures. Good. Feel free. Yeah, no problem. Home, we've got MIG, TIG, and plasma. Yeah. So he can make me anything I want. So I will never buy another one. I mean, yeah. I'll just say, I want it done this way. I want to, like theirs, I want a bigger gap down here. This one at least has a gap. A little bigger gap would give you a little more airflow. Sure, he can punch a gap in there for you real quick. Oh, he could, yeah. <laughs> So theirs is a little different? Yeah, theirs yeah. is a little taller. Would, would uh, go to where the traders were camping to help help them out? Either something really good or really bad. Yeah. Well, they lean towards the really bad, though. Yeah, this was one of the best spots to camp. And uh -huh. downriver from here is a set of waterfalls that you have to portage around. So the Hudson Bay Company eventually built a warehouse and a uh -huh. store here. Uh -huh. Just so that the locals had, could deal with them instead of having to go all the way to Fort oh, Vancouver. Sure. Just did it for scale. Yeah. <laughs> oh, over there. You guys want to go watch? Yeah. Uh, actually, I, I like this though. Yeah. yeah I like watch watching them board and. Uh, You'll be able to hear it go off from here. I don't like, it's too loud. Just put your fingers in your But then how do I know when he's going to fire? <laughs> then I'd go, whoa! I've done that before, like a gun shot, I was like, whoa! And then I'm usually like... Off. It's been grown. The slightest touch will cause it to go off. Without that being pulled, it's a hard, hard pull. So it creates the hair tree. Yeah. It's not a thing. No, uh, unfortunately, no, you're talking about black powder, so safety, you've heard, don't go off half cock, a half cock gun will not go off, got to be on full cock. This is a uh, trade gun, so differences between a trade gun and the rifle that Larry has, number one is I have a flint ignition so there's a piece of flint in here so what happens is we'll put powder in this pan we put the frizzing down and when we pull the trigger then the flint is going to strike the metal shave off a spark which goes in through a little tiny touch hole and ignites the powder in the barrel to make it go off um, a tray gun has a front sight no rear sight you just use the, the the barrel itself to aim. And a trade gun is a smooth bore. It has no riflings in it whatsoever. Um, which when we get done, if you want to look and see kind of the differences you know, between that and the rifle, um, we can do that. So with the trade gun, we can shoot either a round lead ball or we can put buckshot in it if we want to shoot birds. Um, so it's dual purpose because of the smooth bore versus the, the rifling's in it. Um, the trade gun is what we actually gave to the Indians. They all wanted a gun, they wanted the, the rifle, they wanted the gun just like the white man had. So the white man had a rifle, much more accurate, but we said, hey, let's give these trade guns to the Indian. They want a gun? Not as accurate, not as good a distance, so we kind of cheated them. <laughs> you got a question? Um, Larry, can I borrow some powder? I don't know about you women. No. <laughs> we probably have a short string, so we're yeah. trying to... Okay, okay. now I started to say <coughs> in the movies you see them just pour powder from straight in while they're running at 20 miles an hour. Yeah. Ah. On the barrel so it burns faster. And what it's going to do Okay. 
going to keep our fingers crossed that this is going to go off here. So, cover your ears. Smoke ring. Did I get oh, I got a really good smoke ring. It's still going. Yeah, yeah. got a really good smoke ring. Okay, so Carol has a blender, so she used priming powder. I have a percussion. I'm using a percussion cap. So I slide over that. Gotcha. Goes on the, the nipple. Stays there. It's tight. Hair trigger. 